Miss Drew, your host is with the mostest. And yes, of course, I'm back again with another episode with a beautiful moment for you. Now, I'm not gonna lie, it is super, super, super early, but for what I have got in store for you, oh, this one, I mean, you can't even miss a beat. Right now, I'm at this beautiful, beautiful location called the Sea Resort in Pram Pram. Yo, there is so much to do here. But of course, I'm not gonna give it all to you at once, so you know what you need to do. Stick and stay, don't go anywhere. I'll see you after this. resort like I mentioned earlier there are so many things to do now one of my favorite things is that the fact that these people at the sea resort love animals they love nature and they love looking after God's creation so they have a turtle like nest kind of thingy we're gonna go check it out and let's pray that some of the turtles have hatched so that we can release them into mother nature Good morning. Good morning. Welcome. Oh, thank you. Oh my goodness. So I am now in the, what do we call this? The home of all the hatchery. turtles? Hatchery. The hatchery. Oh wow. So this is where all the turtles are basically yes, buried. They're collected from the sea and the buried. eggs. The eggs are collected from here? Yeah, the beach. Uh -huh. And we bring them here. And we bring them here? Yeah. So where did the turtles leave them? Did they just leave them on the floor? No, please. They also come out to dig a hole and bury the eggs. So after that, we also go there to collect the eggs and bring it here and do the same as they did at the beach yes. and bury it here for 50 to 55 days. 50 to 55 days? Yeah. How do you know when a turtle has buried mm. some eggs? What yeah. does it look like? Mm, you, if you go to the beach, you see the tracks. The way they walk from the sea, they walk on the beach. So you see they are foot oh. tracks. So we traced it to the end yes. where they, they ended. Then they will dig a hole and lay the eggs there. Oh, so now we have all of these. Yes, please. Wow. So how long have you been working here? Getting to two years now, but we've done some at the port. Oh my goodness. Yeah, for three years. They are so lovely to be with. Oh. I wish you could come and see some this morning. So it none was, hatched today? No, please. I you were expecting that. It was rather unfortunate. <laughs> this is why we woke up so early. Oh. Just so we'll be able to catch it. But we've missed it. Yes, please. So what do, you, what do you think stopped them from hatching from today? Maybe the weather. Oh, okay. It rained uh, three days ago. So maybe because of that. But some, uh, it's not really the time for them to hatch yet because we have uh, expected it mm -hmm. that it will hatch. But because the weather is somehow hot these days, some hatch before the expected date. Oh wow, so yeah. they like hot weather? Yeah. They like the heat? Yes, please. Oh my goodness. When it's hot, it's, it's, when it's hatch and the weather is hot, it's, male, uh, it's females. But when it's cool, it's male. Ah. Yeah. So roughly, how many eggs do the turtles like mm. give? Last year, like this, we had uh, from a, a turtle, 199. What? So in this basket... No way! <laughs> 199 yes, please. eggs? Yes, please. And they all hatch to turtles? Yes. Oh my God. So tell me a little bit more about, I mean, this, this, what's your favorite thing about seeing them? Oh, I love them so much because when they come out, they are so... And you're not scared? No, it's not scary. <laughs> they are just lovely to see. So many people come from far and near to come and just have a look at them because yeah. they are nice to hold, nice yes. to be with them. So, I mean, what is one thing that everybody watching should know about turtles oh they are animals created by god they are in the sea they save lives mm. when they grow and they are big in the sea maybe when you are on the boat or ship and it's capsided and you are rather uh, lucky to fall on them it brings you out oh wow yeah to save your life so we are also happy working with them to put them more in the sea for yes. them also to save life yes for us. 
So, I mean, I saw a sign out here that said, you know, people shouldn't eat them. Yes, they shouldn't please. boil. People boil turtles. Yes, eat. please. Hey. People collect their eggs and sell and eat. Oh, my And gosh. kill their big oh ones. Oh, my gosh. Hey, Ghana, please behave yourselves. Oh, well, hopefully I'm, gonna, I'm going to be coming every day. One, two, three. When's the next one that's about to hatch? Mm, we are expecting it on the 27th of this month, but because of the weather, it has shown a sign. So maybe it can hatch this night. Eh! Hey, if it's in the night, then call me. I will speed all the way here. <laughs> all right. Oh, thank you so, so much. Just found out something so interesting, guys. Come and see this hole over here. So this means that this is a sign that they have already actually hatched. They've hatched, guys, but because the weather isn't warm, you said, it needs to be nice and warm or nice and hot. And then they'll get the strength to come out. Look, come look at this one. There's a crack, so we can expect this one soon. Can you see? Are you learning, guys? Are you learning? Look at this. It means they have hatched, but we were just unlucky today, man. We were unlucky. I'm going to sit and camp all night, hoping that the Lord gives us warm weather. It's warm weather that they need, right? Warm weather for them to come out. I mean, I'm, you learn something new every day, right? Ah, oh, one day, guys, one day. Remember I said it, it will happen. I will free the turtles. Right. <laughs> Let's see what else they've got over here. my goodness guys honestly the view out here this morning view is absolutely breathtaking i could wake up to this every single day oh right now so i'm here you know gazing at the sea thinking about life just thanking god for that i had the opportunity to even see this and i'm here looking at behind me there are so many things to do here at the sea resort now if you are a gamer this is the place for you there is golf there is volleyball, there is pool, there is all different types of sports for you to take part in over here. Even if you like swimming, the pool looks very, very divine. Now I'm gonna continue going for a bit of a walk and then we're also gonna check out what they've got on the menu. Maybe some breakfast. <laughs> location without having good food right so with all of that exploring and all the other activities to do at resort at the sea resort of course food is also one of the things that you can get and this is a regular breakfast regular breakfast I mean you can get whatever you want a la carte and all that stuff at the sea resort you've got your eggs you've got your hummus you've got your bread your pizza bread of course you got your five a day get your five a day with your fresh 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 juice mm. divine i'm about to enjoy this breakfast guys i'll see you when i'm done <laughs>
end of the clip guys and of course that brings me to the end of this episode it's been too much fun here at the sea resort i've had a great time there is so much to do i'm definitely coming back for those turtles so make sure you keep your eyes glued on this page it's been amazing and i mean i was wondering why is it called the sea resort but i just guessed maybe it is because we are so close to the sea what of you guys i'm about to continue enjoying make sure you follow them on their social medias the sea resort on instagram and all other platforms follow mx and we'll keep you posted but for now guys i'm about to enjoy the view